showing you the full flip through of this beautiful coloring book Time of Wonders of Tai Soon. This is my second book that I finished of this illustrator. I really like her coloring books and uh, so I'm gonna show you how I colored this book and I had a lot of fun coloring. Um, I'm a little bit sad that it's finished now <laughs> but I have some other coloring books of her so I can uh, color still images of her and uh, in this book you can find 24 um, coloring pages and yeah such beautiful grayscale light grayscale but I really like how alcohol markers work on this paper I use different kinds of alcohol markers in this book I think this one if I see it like the colors, this I think this is the Uhu alcohol markers, but I use also some deco time, my twin markers, and other alcohol markers, and also some glitter on some of the pages, of course. And uh, yeah, I really love her illustration. And I use some white gel pen on some of the pages too. Really like this page too with the bunny and with the picky. And I make her a little bit uh, like uh, Red Riding Hood. <laughs> I hope I say that right. Um, I thought it would be funny <laughs> to do that. This one is thinking one of the first pages that I colored in this book. And uh, it's, my, uh, it's a nice summer um, image on the beach. Uh, only thing I think I could have colored that bird another color, but it's it's okay. <laughs> it came out okay. This page was also a lot of fun to color. I uh, colored the roses different kinds of colors, so it gave some uh, plainness, playing. Uh, then I only use one color, and I like the uh, the chickens. I don't know how the name. The little birds. <laughs> I will call them little birds. <laughs> and of course some glitter. I hope you can see it. For the glitter I use different kinds of glitter gel pens. I have a lot of them. And uh, I take every month uh, another kind of brand. So I don't exactly know which I used. Uh, but I love my alcohol markers and my glitter gel pens, so uh, they get a, a lot of love by me. <laughs> this page I really like too. I like the blue and the light blue of uh, the clothes that I choose and all the colors I like. And I use a little bit of uh, metallic uh, gel pen and the white uh, jelly. Not jelly roll, gel, white gel pen. I used the Uni Ball Signo. Yes, that one I used. This page is also a fun page to do. And here I can see I used a other different color of head. But I go over with a darker color because I was not uh, happy with the color that I choose. Um, if you use lighter color you can go over with a darker color. If you make a mistake of you would like to have another color uh, you can do these are also fun this one I like too uh, also the colors that I choose I like Some of them you can find uh, videos how I color them in on my YouTube channel. Um, they are under the playlist uh, Thai Soon. I put uh, most of my videos on uh, the playlist. And also on the playlist Speed Coloring. I think you can find uh, all my other <laughs> speed colorings too. 
and I like how I choose the colors. I let the uh, the jacket gray. I think it suited the colors that I gave uh, the rest of the clothes. And I know I was um, having a hard time what to color uh, the dark uh, hat. I know it took me a long time <laughs> to decide <laughs> which colors. This one is mostly pink and purpley. I like that too. And I made here a boo boo. Maybe you see it, maybe you don't see it, but this is the color. <laughs> it belongs to the ribbon, and I gave it the color of the bear. But uh, well, <laughs> sometimes it happens. Sometimes it is difficult to see uh, which belongs to which item. <laughs> but I, I let it be like this. <laughs> it's okay. This one was also fun to color. I knew I wanted to make it a, a red rocket, <laughs> so that I did first. And then I wanted to use some um, glossy accent for um, the balls, but I didn't do it because um, I was a little bit afraid to do it. <laughs> that is the honest reason. And uh, because I really liked the pictures already and I didn't want to ruin it with uh, using glossy accent. And that's the reason why I don't use a lot of backgrounds neither because uh, I really like the page like it is and yeah this one is <laughs> for all green uh, same thing with the red rack 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 no I cannot find. I knew I wanted to color use the color green and I used some glitter of course also on this page for the glasses uh, sometimes I use uh, for water and glasses glitter gel pen or I use a glossy accent. This one um, was a little bit inspired on Alice in Wonderland, um, the tea time. <laughs> uh, it's called Tea Party. It is also fun for her. Uh, this illustrator, she gave her pages a, a team or an, uh, not a team. Uh, they gave she gave the pages names, but uh, this was inspired on uh, Alice in Wonderland. That is why she's blonde and has a blue dress. <laughs> Maybe he can be the Mad Hatter <laughs> or something like that. I found it funny to do that. This one is also cute. They are all cute in this book. Uh, I cannot decide which page is my favorite page. I uh, really like them all. Here I think um, this could be apples, but I made them blueberry. But I already did it, so they are now blueberries in my eyes. <laughs> and I like that dark blue too. And I like the, like the frog, and she is also beautiful. A little bit of glitter in the bow. This one was also fun to do. I know I made a video on this one too. Oh, for Valentine this year. This one has a whole lot of glitter. <laughs> But I like the blue and the green. This one was also fun to do. Sometimes I have uh, choice issues <laughs> to which color I want to use <laughs> on the page. So sometimes it takes a little bit longer than other times. But the end result is the most important thing, and mostly I like uh, most of my pages. I like sometimes I think I could have chosen another color, but oh well, it is done. This one is also a video on my YouTube channel. I like the bunny and the dog. I think it is a dog. <laughs> I like the blue and the, and the purple that I choose. This one was also quite an easy one. 
I did this in November last year. Let's see. This one was also. I left it white uh, because it's a clown, and for this page, I thought white would be the best uh, choice. So I let it be. And I like the uh, the yellow. No, yellow. Hear me, yellow. <laughs> the red orange hair in combo with the green and the blue and the purple. Yeah, I like it how this grades came out too. This one was also fun to do. Out cute too. This one too. I know I took uh, some time to choose the colors of the shoe. I was not certain well, how to do it or not to do it. Um, but I like the color that I choose at the end, and also with the with the roof and the house at the back side too. Came out quite cute. This one is also nice. I choose different kinds of color again for the flowers. And then we are ready at the last page. I made here a little bit of boo boo, <laughs> but it is uh, not very noticeable. And I used also different kinds of colors. Uh, I had only difficulty which is flower, which is leaf here down. At the end, I choose just the color <laughs> it. If it's right or wrong, you cannot do thinking uh, something right or wrong. It is your own coloring book, so you can do what you want <laughs> with your page. But uh, sometimes it's a little bit difficult to see which uh, is which. And here are all the pages. Uh, that you could find in this book. I marked them with uh, an X when I done it. And I use it also sometimes to see which page I want to color. Because they give it a little bit a uh, quick oversight. And then we have some testing page so you can test your medium out. That's also nice. I don't use it but uh, it's nice that she gave us as to us. So this is The Time of Wonders by Tai Sung, finished coloring book. I'm very happy to finish this book. Um, if you like to see this flip through, please give it a thumbs up. And I have more finished books. You can find them also on my YouTube channel and uh, yeah, you can find them on my YouTube channel. I like to finish my coloring books and um, also sometimes sad that I finish it, but uh, <laughs> that's the other side. Um, so for now I want to thank you for watching this video. And then I will see you in the next video of mine. Bye bye.